perhaps the third HBCU player that they anticipate getting drafted from the University of Arkansas, Pine Bluff, Mark Evans. Projected to go in the seventh round, 6'4", 303 pounds. He's a young man that, again, was a no-star recruit, wasn't ranked by many of the online services. They say it was a number of reasons why he was behind, said so he didn't start to play varsity until his junior year. He was more of a basketball player growing up. He gave another football another chance in seventh grade and continued playing in the high school. He was a young man who Hurricane Harvey disrupted his family. His home was destroyed by the flooding and his family was displaced, spending time at a convention center until they found a shelter. He was noticed by several junior colleges and committed to Navarro Junior College, which was a three-hour drive north of Houston. However, Arkansas Pine Bluff offered him late after signing day, mind you. He committed and went to Arkansas Pine Bluff. His younger brother, Jesse, plays defensive end at Prairie View A&M. One of the things about him, with all the things that Mark Evans II went through, he graduated cum laude. Not thank you, laude. But a 3.A with a degree in biology. He accepted an invitation to play in the East West Shrine Bowl. He was a five year start at Arkansas Pine Bluff, played lined up at left tackle in their up tempo spread scheme. He only had one Division I offer out of high school, and he was thrown into the fire at left tackle as a true freshman. They say he looks looks to quickly close space on pass rushes, but he struggles to maintain versus counters. Overall, his technique and balance tend to deteriorate after first contact, but he works hard to stay square and keep his short defenders occupied. He is a draft and development guard with upside and will continue getting better with NFL coaching. We expect him. Late sixth-round pick.